Hey guys, it's Postbox Pat. Welcome back to a new video. And today I've got some amazing information for you guys. We have finally found out what the rocket in Fortnite is going to be doing to Fortnite Battle Royale. However, let's talk about something that I'm going to be doing in the future before we get into this video because it's pretty important because I've never ever done this on the channel. Me and a few other YouTubers have planned a giveaway for you guys to give you guys V-Bucks the season pass for season five, and also a bunch of other cool items, hopefully, as well. So we're going to be releasing that very, very soon. So if you are interested in that, stick around on my channel. It's going to be coming to every single video that, and it'll be in the description of every single video upcoming in the next week or so. So stay tuned for that. I can't wait to give you guys a giveaway. Finally, a legit giveaway, which I can actually give you guys some stuff. But what else am I going to be doing on my channel? I also am going to be doing a video for you guys to understand how to get free V-Bucks once again for Season 5. Now, last season, I made a video on how to get free V-Bucks for Season 4, and obviously, it's changed a little bit, and it worked really well. A lot of people gained access to it. So many people got V-Bucks, so I thought this time, I'll be doing the exact same thing, showing you guys exactly how you can get Season 5 for free. But obviously, it's hard, and it's not as easy as you think to work. And to get it to kind of just play out for you guys, it's not as easy as that. So, I don't want to talk about it too much because it's not really related to this video but let's hop straight into this and show you guys what i want to show you guys today about the rocket so the rocket itself is the giant giant thing above omega's base well as we once thought omega's base but is it really omega's base and what exactly has it got to play in the storyline now if you guys don't already know i have been covering the storyline i've been saying how the rocket's going to take off and stuff like that and where's it going to go and stuff but now we have evidence that the rocket is most likely i'm 60 no i'm about 60 to 80 percent certain that this rocket is going to take off and we're going to get the opportunity to launch it so as you can see on screen right now we have some leaked in-game files once again the credit is down below these files actually show us how does a launch option to launch the rocket that means that the rocket is going to maybe even in game be able to take off and we've obviously seen the screens around the map counting down i made a video on that yesterday with the picture of omega's base and people are actually predicting maybe this tuesday or this monday i don't even know or maybe even this thursday some sometime this week coming up we're going to be able to actually launch the rocket for ourselves and send it into the fortnite map now how cool would the dynamic be of this is if you land at this base here you'll be able to send it up as you guys see in my thumbnail i have the screenshot of it going up you'd be able to send it up into the sky and it could hit a random location this would put a dynamic element into the idea of fortnite meaning the map would change every single game for example you could launch that rocket one game it could hit maybe dusty one game it could hit tilted one game it could hit moisty Meyer, and the other game it could hit fatal fields now that is only a possibility and everything i'm going to say in this video are only predictions for this but it is most likely going to happen this season or the end so to say the end of this season or the start of next season we're going to see that rocket either going to a new map in space or hitting somewhere on the map now i don't exactly know and i can't exactly say where this rocket is going to hit but for you guys it is definitely interesting to find out where you guys think it's going to hit because i did a forum or kind of like a post type thing on my channel my forum section on my community section whatever you want to call it and people were actually saying that it's going to hit moisty Meyer. now that was a prediction for season four for the end of season four it was actually a prediction for that the moisty mire itself would actually be destroyed in fortnite and never return now that itself would make perfect sense and in yesterday's video i talked a little bit about how moisty mire possibly won't all be destroyed and it'll just be one section looking at moisty mire from the angle we are right now personally i think it'll be this section of moisty mire that'll get destroyed or it'll be this section over here not many people land over there leaving the main section of moisty mire still available because the wood grind there is absolutely insane i can't see them wiping the entire section of this map but obviously there's a lot of dead space around here leading up to fatal fields but you can't make the map too crowded or it loses that kind of feel that fortnite has now a lot of fans out there have been complaining that they have been changing the map a lot personally it's not something i like to complain about because it keeps the game fresh and it keeps new things to discover and new places to explore obviously people like the map to be the same for example myself i did really like the hogwarts places a lot of people called it by where the football field is but you know adding in new areas and new dynamics to the map it just allows us to explore new things and kind of get that feel that a lot of people want when they're playing fortnite now back on topic to the rocket itself who will be launching this rocket i don't exactly know if you listen now on screen i actually have a clip for you guys listen closely and apparently there is actually someone laughing in the background listen really closely it's either going to be blockbuster or omen but take a little listen to this guys Thank you. 
So as you can see, every now and then it kind of has like a little electronic laugh type thing and it really is a cool type thing. I don't know exactly if we want that sort of aspect in the game of Fortnite. I know a lot of people out there are talking about these superheroes and villains and obviously that was part of the story relating to the film and the director and stuff. If you haven't already checked out my story playlist, make sure you go and do that because it makes perfect sense so you understand exactly what's going on within Fortnite. But generally, let's kind of like talk a little bit about the idea of it with the blockbuster and stuff like that, having secret noises and stuff. It's a little bit mysterious and it's not something that a lot of people like, but you know, it happens and things like that. Now, I've also been getting a few tweets on Twitter with people saying that they can hear drum roll around the map as they're walking around. Now, personally, I couldn't hear anything myself and I don't believe this, but just to cover it in the video, just in case you guys are hearing any drums around the map, if it is the case, it possibly just leads to the countdown that we saw in yesterday's video. I will put it on screen right now the little picture of the tv counting down that is a pretty interesting concept as well we have the countdown which kind of does show the idea of omega himself kind of building his army and building up to take you guys out or i don't when i say omega is it really omega or is it omen i don't know the exact answer to that personally i think it's omen but omega himself was an actor and i do like to say omega's army because we saw that screenshot but i don't exactly know if that is the concept and if we can believe that or not omega himself is a cool character and we don't know if he is the enemy or not but we'll have to wait and see and find out what exactly is going to happen within Fortnite Battle Royale. Personally, I do predict that Omega is nothing to do with the enemies and that these new enemies, for example, the Blockbuster skin, the Visitor and Omen have their own kind of play in the story of Fortnite Battle Royale. So we've got to consider that and kind of think about Omega and stuff being as actors as we know at the end of their movie, which ended a few weeks ago, about week six or week seven, their movie actually ended and they were all chilling inside of this area. It looked like they were chilling somewhere around here. It was kind of like a director set, something like this they were chilling in, something like this. And they were looking towards, oh, uh, what's his name? They were looking towards omen's mountain i keep i don't know to call it omen and mega's base because people know it as different names and the villain's base the huge area people know it as that but you know that the story ended only a few weeks ago now if we go inside of it and you're actually in the actual game now unfortunately in the mode i'm in theater mode we're not going to see anything inside of here but if we go inside there are actually a bunch of things in the swimming pool hot rocks to be exact the hot rocks in here can be used in game obviously but it's kind of interesting how he's storing them in a pool maybe it's not exactly a pool but it, to me it definitely looks like a swimming pool uh, but maybe it's not i don't know the exact definition what that could be but maybe he's just storing the hot rocks in there and also we have a bunch of meteorites inside of his base we've got one in here and we go up here there's not is there any up here yeah they're, they're, there they are they're just around here so we've got all the meteorites along this wall right here so all these meteorites that have come down from space have been used in here to power this rocket the lights are on this rocket is ready to go and who knows exactly where it could go personally i think it's going to probably go the height of the battle bus which is like up here and then possibly hit another target on the map but it could fly out the map and there's the battle bus so about the same height now a bit higher probably but maybe it'll go the height of the battle bus and then come straight down onto the map so i don't know the exact reason for this and don't know the exact definition but i can predict something like that now if you are new to the channel do stick around for daily fortnite content because i bring out a variety of different fortnite videos for you guys covering the storyline covering tips and tricks covering all sorts of stuff for you guys from all different like genres of fortnite should i say trying to keep you guys up to date but at the moment the most trending thing out there is the story a lot of people are a little bit confused with what's going on i will be bringing a recap video out very very soon related to the story Story, and also there'll be some new updates on the story as soon as the map changes so keep you guys up to date with that i will drop a video on that other than that i'll try and do a recap video of the entire story very soon if you haven't already though i do have a playlist with all of the videos in that i do recommend checking out because it will keep you guys up to date with exactly what's going on from what we know from these leaked files i personally do think this rocket is going to have a massive play on season five and will launch off somewhere into the map maybe this week or maybe at the start of season five or end of season four and hit somewhere on the map by the predictions and the leaks that we
we got very early on, like I said at the start of the video, the most likely place for this is Moisty Maya. But due to my like post and my community section, again, a lot of people said Moisty Maya. Other common places were Tilted Towers and people were saying Dusty. And a few other concepts was that it could hit in between Dusty and Loot Lake and end up flooding Dusty as well, causing a massive water area, causing maybe like a pirate bay, something like that related to the Season 5 theme, which possibly could appear within Fortnite Battle Royale. They're the different concepts people have been coming up with, but these are only theories. Do leave your comment down below of what you guys think is going to happen. Remember, if you've got a theory, leave it down below in the comment section down below, and a lot of people will respond if it is a great theory. I've seen a bunch of different theories popping up on my videos, and I've been reading them, I've been favouriting them, or loving them, whatever you want to say, the little heart comment, or whatever it is, and you guys have been liking them as well. So if you've got a really good theory, and people do like it, it will get up there in the top comments. So I've seen a bunch of different stuff like that, so make sure you do go and comment one down below if you have one also if you made it all the way to the end of this video do leave in your comment at the end of the comment or just leave a comment saying this if you've got nothing else to comment comment down below risky because that's where we are right now if you made it to the end of this video and it will be interesting to see how many of you have actually made it to the end of the video obviously i love to see that because it shows dedication on my channel and it's the true subscribers obviously sometimes you can't watch all of the video and that is fair enough but if you have watched the entire video congratulations to making it to the end don't forget to stick around for daily fortnite content giveaways are coming very very soon with free vbook videos as well telling you guys how to gain access to them to get season five for free also we'll be giving away a bunch of different season five battle passes to you guys i haven't done a proper giveaway on my channel ever so this is going to be the first time for a proper full-on giveaway i have given away a few v-bucks in the past but nothing major i'm not the sort of channel for doing giveaways so do kind of forgive me if you don't want me to do that it's just something that people have been asking for so many different people have been asking for giveaways and i thought you know this is the time now let me give you guys some stuff because you guys have been asking all of the time to gain access to it and this is the time for me to give back to you so it's going to be a legit giveaway it's going to be absolutely awesome i've teamed up with a bunch of different youtubers to get as much as we can for you guys obviously i don't want to give so i can't give away everything i've got i'll be living on the streets but i've teamed up with a bunch of different people so we can work together and give you guys as much as we can hope you guys have enjoyed don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe and once again this is postbots pat signing out